Mary's Meals is a school feeding program for the world's poorest children. Millions of children throughout the world are so poor that they can't even think about going to school. They spend the average day begging, scavenging, or having to work in sometimes dangerous conditions simply to put the next meal on the table. Mary's Meals is a very simple intervention where we offer that child a nutritious meal to sustain life, but we offer that meal in a place of learning, in a place of education. And of course, the food will look after their immediate needs, but education will be their route out of poverty. Well, I found out about Mary's Meals when I um, went in for the first parish competition because they had a stand there. Um, and they decided on the 10th of October last year to create a World Porridge Day, which is now the 10th of October every year. Um, and because I won it on the first Porridge Day, I thought, well, I've got to get behind these guys. They're, they're a fantastic little charity when you find out about them. Everybody involved are volunteers. Uh, they're now feeding over half a million children around the world. Um, they're providing a meal in school every day for these kids. Um, and giving them a great start in life, which they just wouldn't otherwise have had. The food that we give these children is a locally sourced porridge type mix called the Kuni Pala. And that fortified porridge mix that we, gives the, we give them that costs us £6.15 pence to feed a child a whole school year, gives that child everything it needs for health, well-being, and most importantly, gives that child the ability to be alert and concentrate in school so they have meaningful learning while they're in the school. Well, today I'm going to be serving porridge to the First Minister, Alex Salmond, and some members of his cabinet, uh, which is very exciting. Uh, I have met Alex Salmond many years ago, I'm sure he won't remember, but I do, and um, I'm looking forward to meeting him again. World Porridge Day is Mary's Meals Global Day, where we invite everybody across the world to have porridge or an oat-based product as a mark of solidarity with children for whom it is their only meal of the day. So that's been illustrated fantastically here today by the First Minister breaking off from his very busy schedule to just sit down, eat porridge and think about the world's poorest children and the fact that it costs three pence for Mary's meals to feed that child in a day, that that is something that perhaps everybody could make a contribution towards.